Hi guys, welcome to my channel once again. So the um, or not again if you're new. The port dev server just got live. So like I did before, I will once again go over everything. Uh, freeze the frame for like five seconds so you can make a screenshot for yourself. That's tier one. Tier two. Tier three. Tier four. Tier five. America. Tier one. Tier two. Tier three. Tier four. Tier five. Germany. Tier one. Tier two. Tier three. Tier four. Tier five. Japan, there's only four tiers. This is tier one. Tier two. Tier three. Tier four. Okay, that's one. Now, I'm going to show you guys how to make silver. The best way to make silver. I made a video about it yesterday. It got 14 views. And the videos before that, uh, the video before that got 1,000 views in three days. So I don't know what else is going on with the algorithm. But so we're going to soldiers. Um, 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 I think I'm going to America for a second. And I have, I think it's tier... It's, tier three yeah that's the highest level i have so this is a tier three unit i can switch that and then i can send to the rear you need to apply action of moving salt to the reserve first ah okay whatever um if i sell this one soldier it's 8350 silver yeah I bought this one yesterday for 1,000 silver. So if you're in the current enlisted and you have silver orders, the silver orders, they will be valued 1,000 silver. But the units, even the lowest unit, let's see, this one is, uh, I have to go here. This one is the lowest unit, um, level one, battle rating one, everything one. Let's say I'm going to sell it. I get 2,650. So to anyone that still has silver orders right now, even uh, spend them all even if you buy the cheapest unit they will get you 2.65 uh random and uh, how the fuck do you say that in english i don't know profitability basically times two points uh this so that's the best way right now to make money if you're still in the old game buy units the best is the highest that you can get because uh tier one to tier two goes from like 2700 to 6000 i'll make a screenshot in the edit to show you the value no one saw that video it wasn't recommended so i just put that information in here um then the next thing how to unlock better pass vehicles yeah so let's say this is usa right uh here i have the jumbo you unlocked it at level 20 or 21 in the current normandy campaign um but I bought in the battle pass. Go almost all the way down. Here, the M4 A176. This, I cannot use this right now, and I can also not use it in the old unlisted. Um, but it says over here in the tech tree at tier 4 that this one, this quad, if you click here, you can see the squad. This quad is used for all of these. Um, 
and it's all all the other countries except for japan have the same system so you have to buy this quad in order to be able to use this the stupid part is i can use this because this one uses a different squad apparently which is a bit odd um, but for over here i have the is1 which i can currently not use um oh and the cave one can i use that no neither but the point is you have to buy the squad so you go over here and then you buy this squad I'm gonna do it for USA because I only have money for one um, nation. Buy the Jumbo Squad. Take reward, 15,000. We got a new squad. I unlock this squad. And then I, uh, oh, maybe I'm so, ah. Okay. Now then we go. Is there a way to do things? Yep. Jumbo. So, oh, that would be awesome. <laughs> I can do two jumbos because it's a different squad. This is probably only going to count for the ones that got it like before the merge. But theoretically, you can use two jumbos. Um, this is a new one with only three squad uh, crew members over here. Yeah, yeah, you see? Now I can use this one. Um, I'm pointing at the screen with my finger, but. I don't know the webcam yet. Uh, this one, which I bought from the Battle Pass, 1200 gold. So now I can use this. Uh, then I'm just going to show for the purpose of uh, the video. Um, I'm going to send to the rear 8,000. Yes, received 8,000. Sold, close. Now I have 15,000 again. Now I'm going to the Soviet Union. Uh, T-34. Once again, I have to buy stuff I already have. I do really not like that idea. But, I mean... I guess it's the way it's gonna be. Uh, I would like to have... At, or the the silver given from Gaijin, Darkflow. Because I already have the vehicle. I already have this. I used it a ton of times. So, either get this, give this to us from the developer. Uh, or remove that we have to buy that because we already have it so that's weird so this one can use the is1 which is good uh so select so i can use this one and this one and if i was to go over here i have to get this crew so what i would research next personally is this one then i get this crew this quad and this quad I use for T50, T28, T34, T34, and KV1. And like I already showed you guys, I have the KV1 over here. But I can currently not use this because I need the other squad. Uh, then we go to Germany, which is for me not very good news. Um let's see i need this one this quad to unlock the tigers uh i i'm not going to show it i have this i bought it from the better pass as well oh um but for to use that i need this quad to unlock this vehicle i need to unlock this vehicle and to unlock this vehicle i need to unlock this vehicle uh and it goes all the way back to over here uh, this is the squad that's used for all of that stuff and I need that squad before I can unlock that one So don't pin me down on that. I'm not sure if I have to research all the vehicles I think I do this. This is a solid line. You see that? So I'm pretty sure that um, Maybe these these this is folded with another one because I do have that one I'm not sure. I think it might be that if I unlock this quad, I can unlock that squad, and that's enough to unlock everything. But I think this is going to be a... And that we have to get this, 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 and this, and that before I can unlock the tiger. Uh, so that's a bit less good or less enjoyable. But this is tier 5. I already mentioned in my previous overview, like this has the same armor as a rank 2 or maybe rank yeah 53 millimeter armor and this one has a little over 100 millimeters of penetration the ammo and 53 50 
um, that's tier one, not even tier two, that's tier one. And here you have a tier four, same armor as the other one with tier one, only the cannon is a big, bit better. But this cannon is similar to the Panzer IV, 75 millimeter from the Panzer IV H and stuff. But this one is at rank four and the Panzer IV, even this one is tier four. It's also the 75, the long 75. Uh, and this is tier three. So Japan is in terms of ground vehicles, they're pretty much uh, after the A. Now I'm going to do a match straight away uh, to see how much we earn with the average, um, average match, average platoon. Okay, now let's go. We're gonna have a match right now. <laughs> okay, now granted this was a bad, not a yeah, pretty bad game in terms of score and stuff. Not super impressive at all, but only 580 silver and this is 5.4 including the this so it's double for the premium and with the squad and then times 1.2 so if you don't have premium the reward for this match for nine minutes of at best average gameplay yeah would be 500 580 silver and without premium, only 1,900 research points. Now, if you go over here real quick to see how much... Yeah, one weapon, 3,000. Uh, one tier one weapon, 500. So that 10 minutes is one weapon. And you need like... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Like 20 at least 20 and then preferably for your tank crews you give them some machine gun or some pistol or something um so yeah the earnings can definitely definitely be better um well thank you guys for watching i hope this was informational or how do you say that <laughs> informative <laughs> speak three languages so uh have a good day everyone bye bye